This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this excerpt, I answer a question on how to get rid of fuzzy edges in a chroma key in Final Cut Pro 10. Barry Stone writes, I shoot four band members individually against a small green screen, then use a draw mask to just include the person inside the green. The keys are good, but there's a one pixel line where the masks overlap. Why? And the answer is, you need to turn off soften in the keyer effect. This is an example. I have four band members. I don't have musical band members, so I'm using Andrew. And you'll notice that I've got this thin gray line here. Harumph. Well, let's just hide three of the band members. Select the clip, type the letter V to make it invisible. Select our top clip and we'll turn on the transform setting. Transform. And move Drew down here so we can see those lines better. The reason those lines exist is because of a single setting inside the keyer. If I go to the video inspector and show, got to select the clip, and show the keyer and scroll down inside the keyer to map tools, see the setting right here, soften. What soften does is it softens the edge between the foreground and the background object. The problem is it tends to not look as good as you expect and it especially causes problems with this edge. All I have to do is take soften to zero, and that line disappears. I like shrink and expand, and I do use erode. I use levels more. I've got a session on chroma key that talks about that. But be very, very careful about using soften, because you're going to get that strange edge when it's up, and the edge is gone when it's turned off. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar called Ask Larry Anything. For the complete list of all of our training, please visit our store at LarryJordan.com slash store. And by the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library can save you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's more than 1,900 movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com membership. And thanks.